recognition. What we're going to explain to you today is that LiDAR is, is a fool's errand. And, any, and anyone relying on LiDAR is doomed. <laughs> doomed. Expensive, expensive sensors that are, are unnecessary. It's like having a whole bunch of expensive appendices. Like one appendix is bad, well, now they want to put a whole bunch of them. That's ridiculous. <laughs> You'll see. There's somebody up here. I was a huge proponent of LiDAR, and I It was I the it. sauce, right? Well, that was not my quote, but I, I definitely um, believed that that was actually the unlocking factor. Uh, you know, an, a, a wiser person than me, and I'll eat some humble pie here, said that LiDAR is a crutch. Yeah, I was and just it, about to ask you about that. Yeah. So you would agree with Elon Musk, he said, and he's been ridiculed for that a bit. Um, he's for, right. For calling LiDAR a crutch, and that's what you believe as well. I believe that as well. And I don't believe that because I can't do it, because I'm happy to do that. It's just not where I think the actual value is coming from. And, and you could look at that, right? So if you were to like analyze all the disengages that people have done, and try to break it down, like what's the actual real reason behind that? Is the real reason because the brakes weren't redundant or the steering wasn't redundant? Nope, in fact, that's like 0.0% of all disengages are because there was no fail operational system. All of them are software failure, and they're mainly a software failure um, you know, on mature companies um, at trying to understand what the vehicle's gonna doing or the pedestrians around you, and you having a misunderstanding or miscommunication with them. And so that's, the, that's where the value is gonna be. Now,